Hello you. Yes, ten computer hits. Ten computer hits, one in fact. Now, I'm a bugger for compilations. It's taken me how long to get through ten computer hits? Three? Several years. <laughs> and, yeah, I haven't quite completed live action, live ammo compilation either, have I? Still got to do Great Escape, God. And so many compilations, so why am I starting another one? Well, I don't know. Um, <clears throat> but I was thinking, I played 10 Computer Hits 3 for ages, and I lo loads of the games on that. And then a while ago, a few years ago, I got 10 Computer Hits 2, but I haven't got around to playing it yet. And then recently, more recently, I got the first one. So I thought, there we go, I can start at the beginning and see how they're like. But as you can see, the first game that's loaded up should be Brian Jack's Superstar, which I wasn't particularly looking forward to, because I'm getting a whole... Um, Jeff Cape Strongman from uh, Computer Hits 3 on that one, and that wasn't much fun. Um, but get it out of the way, and then we've got Llamasoft after this. So, But um, it loads up first 10 computer hits, and it's this, apparently. So, 37 blocks in, we've just got a bit of bump to say. Uh, well, anyway, press any key, what happens now? You must rewind the tape fully and zero the tape counter before making a note. Yeah, yes. Make so then and sift all loads in two parts. Ooh, didn't know that. There'll be a short period of blank screen until the second part. Please do not stop the tape. Okay. Any key? <laughs> right. Do I have to load this in every time then? You've got to load in this menu before you can look. I can't just zip to. I don't. Mm, right. Well, we're going Brian Jacks because it's next on the tape, hopefully. Let's sprint them. Any key to reset and continue. Oh, <laughs> great. <laughs> Shift front up. Well, well, there we go. I thought I'd save you the loading of the first one, but came back to the screen and it was... Oh, right. So there we go. <clears throat> Move the lamp out of the way. Sit down. Chin, chin. Doctor number three. <clears throat> Found Brian Jacks. There we go. I have found that Brian Jacks. <clears throat> Next. I suppose I could be reading the instructions at this point, couldn't I? Where did I put the instructions? Oh. El instrucciones. Uh, oh, right, hang on then. So, Brian Jacks goes up to 93 and we're currently up to 51. Oh, we'll need some serious padding here, won't we? Uh, dee -dee 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 -dee. These instructions have been kept to a minimum. Good, good. Most of the strategy involved is for you to discover. Oh dear. Uh, playing instructions joystick only important. The Commodore 64 versions of swimming canoeing. <laughs> swimming canoeing. No, no comma there. Swimming canoeing. Um, running and cycling incorporate power sync. This means that the rate at which you move the joystick from side to side to build up power must be synchronised to the screen action. As in real life, speed of movement in these events must build up gradually, while thrashing about at the beginning will achieve very little. Well, there's a phrase, isn't there? You, you, you could apply that to many. That could be good advice in many uh, situations, that while thrashing about at the beginning will achieve very little. In one player option, you will first go through a qualifying round to see if you are a suitable standard. Ooh before you are accepted as a challenger. You have to remember that Brian is a very busy man and can only find time to fight off serious contenders. <laughs> Go away! <clears throat> right. Gera. In the two-player option, you will be playing against a friend, or enemy, or whoever else is the joystick, I suppose. But once again, if you obtain a suitable score, you will get the chance to both complete, oh, to, you can both complete against Brian. Should you... Should both of you be of the required standard, the one with the higher score will go through as the challenger. Select which option you require, push the joystick forward or backward, and the cursor will move. Blah, 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 blah. Canoeing. Gradually increase the stroke rate by moving the joystick from side to side. Brackets, power sync. That was sounding rude to start with. To correct drifting into lane markers, hold the stroke slightly longer on one side. Right, so left stroke, right stroke with left joystick, right oh, okay then. The bore shoot. Move the sight across using the joystick. To fire the crossbow bolt, press the fire button. Okay, I guess we can work that one out. 
100 meter sprint, you will need to be fast to qualify. Power sync at the start only. And then thrash it wildly, is it? Squat thrusts. You have 60 seconds to complete as many squat thrusts as you can. Will not be counted if either your knees do not come up to your elbows or your knees. Blah, blah, blah. Moving joystick to one side moves you in that one direction. And right, so waggling but slowly. Swimming. Increase your stroke rate by moving the joystick from side to side. Power sync. Okay, let's just get into it, eh? <coughs> ah, need another move full of tea. It's very quiet, isn't it? Have I turned the volume down? Yes, I have. <laughs> That's probably good enough, I would have thought. This is early, isn't it? 1985. Actually, this seems a bit basic, even for 1985. Hopefully, I've got the right waggly joystick for this. And... Oh, let's turn the lamp off. That's probably not helping matters, is it? Right. Press fire. No. Press space. <laughs> Good start. Wrong. No, hang on. If I press space, that would have been the same as pressing fire as a joystick in port one. So, what's with this? F1. Didn't say anything in there. Now turn the lamp out, don't I? <coughs> Excuse me. It doesn't say how to start. Once you've decided on the game you want to play, press the fire button. Select which option you require, push the joystick forward or backward, and the cursor will move between the two options. What two options? Forward, backward, forward, backward, forward, backward, forward, I know. No. Uh, don't tell me we have to wait for the tune to finish. Um. Push the joystick forward or back and the cursor will move between the two options. Once you've decided the game you want to press the button. Well, that's what I'm doing. <coughs> See, witness? I am pressing fire. Yes, this one is plugged in, he says. Let's plug you into port one, eh? Come on, out you come, out you come. Oh, where are you? You're around here somewhere. There we go. And up. Right, so it's just to import one then. Right. Hmm. Bit of a mix of you've got some high res stuff in the middle and then you've got system characters and chunky hmm, okay. What was it left and right? <coughs> Which one am I? Left, right. Left, right, left, right, left, right. No, this doesn't seem to... Oh, so much for the doing it slowly. Look at me now. Everything went into a blur then. That's it. I mean, the numbers are going past so fast, I can't see what they're saying. <coughs> Sorry about that. <clears throat> My throat is really <clears throat> at the moment. Bore shoot. But there was no sound in that. Was oh my word. Did I eat it? Oh, it's coming from the right, is it? Is that what that arrow there means? No. Yes, no. Oh, I see that. Right, okay. That's showing where I'm actually hitting it on the target, if I do manage to hit it on the target. No, and I'm only allowed one shot each time. And... Well, it's in the white. And out the red. Nothing in this game, etc, etc. Uh, balls. I do better on those ones, don't I? This one I have not hit at all. Oh, but what a comeback. And... Didn't notice which one that was then. Four on target, and only one on target, but it was a bullseye. I don't know how that scores. Ah! Can he get a ball as well? 
Probably not at that range. No. That looked like a hippo. That's a bit odd, isn't it? <coughs> Does Brian Jacks regularly shoot hippos? Is that what this game is saying? 100 metres. A wild light crazy. Ooh, those are big sprites, aren't they? And... Go, Brian! Go on! Go on, you just strangely angular elbows there. He can go faster than this, Brian. Come on. Oh, look, he's just suddenly skipping over the line. God, that would have killed me on my old Pointmaster joystick. Yes, and... Oh, squat thrust. This looks wrong. All oh, right. So, waggle one way, waggle the other. Waggle one way, waggle the other. You can't just do one back and forth. It has to be two. Ah, sneaky. Okay. It looks very wrong though, doesn't it? Especially in a sort of PE school gym sort of. <laughs> Not right. You can imagine those ropes and ropes on the wall being used for other devices, other uses. Yeah. Um, hmm. There's someone probably in that wooden horse filming this, isn't there? Hey, hey, hey. This is a bit tedious. I've no idea what score I'm supposed to be reaching. Whether this is good or woeful. But I don't know if I can just have a rest. Does that look any better? I don't know. All of these look wrong. Especially with it, especially with the what looks like nappy on. It's like... I'm not going to get 42, am I? 40, 41, okay. Is that good enough? No idea. <laughs> Did they score 760 on that? Right. <laughs> uh, swimming, I'm guessing this is like running as well then. Oh, fuck it. We'll catch him up just by sheer dint of us going faster, hopefully. Solve the slow start. We're not going to make it, are we? I mean, he's not going any faster, seemingly, is he? Yeah, I could have just gone for that from the start, I think. Still, mm, we've got half their score. <laughs> Gold 70, right, okay, we've got one gold, they've got... Oh, God. Um, I have no idea what to do here now. I hadn't read that far ahead in the instructions. There. No. Pfft. Football. Right. Opponent got two goals in the... What? What? No idea. It appears to be glued to his foot. What, am I supposed to fire it or what? Or am I supposed to just run with it as fast as I can and walk it in? Not a clue. Is that too false? I'd better try pressing the fire button at some point. Okay, we're doing cycling now, it would appear. Am I, can I fall off as well? I'd say that's a pretty um, good start there, isn't it? I'm ahead of him, aren't I, I think? Hard to tell now. He might be gaining on me. Can I go? Can I risk going faster? Or is that going to stuff it up? Is this the rhythm? Is it the rhythm method? Or am I supposed to thrash about frantically? <laughs> Ooh, nice scenery, isn't it? I mean, there is a quite nice feeling of depth in those blue, pink, and yellow blobs getting smaller into the distance. It does look like a big crowd. Oh, I can stop waggling. It does look like a big crowd. Well, uh, it looks like a big crowd of three colours of blocks, but it looks like there's a lot of them. Ah, right, okay. And there was no third place. The computer has beaten you! Exclamation mark. Exclamation. Yeah, there's just something about the way that's written. It just made me think they'd spelt it it's not you wrong. It just seems so. Oh, I know you've been beaten. 
Uh, yes, okay. Mm. So that's Brian Jack's Superstar Challenge. Is his name Jax? Or is his name Brian Jack? And there's supposed to be an apostrophe in there. I don't know. No, it is Brian Jax, isn't it? But if it's his superstar challenge, shouldn't there be an apostrophe at the end? Mm, oh, God, I can't believe I'm going down this route. Yes, Brian Jack's superstar challenge. Look at those chunky, chunky pixels. <clears throat> Nothing else quite like that, is there? Yes, on the Commodore 64. And if you'll excuse me, I'm going to go and load something better now. But I hope you enjoyed watching. Catch you on the next one, maybe. Ta-ta.